Good evening. No, good afternoon. This is Tina. Okay, how's your weekend? Uh, in this video, we're gonna talk about multi key index. Um, just to talk about the limitations, how to create that, and we're gonna have another video which give. Uh, um, when we do a query, there are something special when we're using multi key index. Okay, we're gonna separate it into two videos. Okay, first. Uh, uh, let's talk about what is a multi-key index. We have already uh, learned uh, single field index and uh, compound index. For those index, the value of the field is uh, it's not an array, which means they are either which is a string value or numeric values. Uh, Multi key index. Yes, uh, when we add an index, okay, on the field in a collection, the field will hold the value of an array. And uh, by doing that, MongoDB will create a multi key index. The reason for multi key is array have the different elements right array will have many elements and uh, mongodb will create an index for each of element in the array so each element in the array we are gonna be a key inside the index structure and uh, for one document we have many elements referred to that document, which is a multi key. That's why that's why a multiple key, which is, that's why it has it called a multi key index. So let me show you how to create it. Then I'll give you an example to explain again. Okay. So here I was using inventory dot find. Here for our tags is an array, right? So now if I create an index db dot inventory dot create index and which is uh, using tags, which is ascending, okay? And uh, because of the field, the value of the the tags field value is an array. So it's gonna MongoDB by default will automatically create a multi key index for these tags. Uh, and uh, the method, we're still using the same method as uh, the single field or compound, okay? So it's gonna be, gonna be the same. So after we're using get index, you will see it's already been created. And now let's take a look, take a look at this. Uh, this document and we go here and I just put it here okay so now in our single field or compound okay each document this is our index structure this part is minimum this part is maximum right in our single field one key in the index, it's gonna refer to one document, right? But for the multi key, it's not. Multi key is here I have A, B, C. So all of them gonna be the key inside the, the uh, index structure. And A will also refer to this document. B can also refer to the document. C can also refer to the first document. So for one document, for one document, okay, we have multiple keys in the index. This is called a multi key index. Got it? I think now you got it, okay? Because for our single field, like the ID on the index for the primary key, right? Index, okay, we only has one key here. One will refer to this one and or two, two gonna refer to this one. So one document only has one key, but for array, you have multiple keys. Each element gonna be a key, so it's a multi-key index. And a multi-key index has limitations. It have three limitations. Um, the first one is suppose we want to create a compound index. Do you remember? What is compound index? Compound index, where, uh, which is the index structure, which um, one index will 
a uh, reference to multiple fields in our uh, <laughs> collection uh, document, right? Which means we have a uh, two two fields. Okay, when we create index, we have more than one field, more than one field, and uh, if we create a compound multi key index, only one array type is allowed, which means uh, like this. Okay, uh, let's let's let, 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 let me show you. Let me show you here. Suppose now I want to create a compound index based on quantity and a text. Okay, you can db dot inventory dot create index, which is based on quantity one and the tags one. It's allowed. Okay, it's allowed. See here, it's allowed. Okay, because in this compound index, we only has one field, which attacks here, which attacks here is the multi key, okay, which is array, and the, the quantity is not an array, okay. And if for the compound index, we have a two key, two key, okay, uh, sorry, two field holds the array value, then we cannot. Let me give you one example. Uh, db dot in a uh, collection which using test collection okay dot insert let's insert uh, this one a is uh, an array and also b is an array okay oh oh do you know what i forgot to add this brace to the end and now I using db test call, call collection dot find you will see this document right and now if I want to create a, a multi key index it's it, you can do like a, a db dot uh, test col dot in, uh, create index and we can give a ascending order it's fine, okay. Like uh, if we use db dot test col dot get indexes, it can get this one being created, right? Now let me find again, okay. This is our structure, but now I want to create a multi key in a uh, compound multi key index based on a and b, not allowed. Let me show you db dot test col dot uh, create index. And now I will using A and B. Ascending, B, ascending. Not allowed. You will say fail. See here, cannot index parallel arrays. Because in our compound index, we have uh, two. What, what's the thing? We have uh, two fields which their value type is an array, which is not allowed. Got it? Okay. And now. Let me show you another example. Now I drop this uh, test column. Okay, I will create again. Okay. Drop. Okay, and then uh, show collections. Now we don't see this one, right? Now I using test db test col dot uh, create as uh, insert insert sorry insert one, and now I will give one and b is one. Okay, right? Okay. So now let me create index, okay? db dot, uh, uh, oh, let me show you the value inserted, okay? This is the value we inserted, right? Now I using db dot test col dot uh, create index, I will create compound index. A as, uh, ascending, b, we can using descending, okay? A saying a design doesn't matter, okay? The uh, component matters. If you want to know, go to my compound index, okay? So now I have an index which is on A and B, right? Now, uh, because in MongoDB by default the document is uh, schemaless, okay? Now if I ins so far the index is just a normal compound index. Now I using db dot test column dot uh, test collection dot insert one. Now I insert A to be the array. 
and the B to be just a nine. Okay, will it insert it successfully? Yes, it will insert it successfully because even though here I have a compound index here, right? But uh, after I insert in the do in inside the docker inside the collection, only A holds an array, and uh, then this index. Previously, it's a compound index. Now, it will automatically change it to be compound multi-key index because the value I insert for the A is an array type now, not a single value as before. So if I do like this, you will insert it successfully. Dot, what's the uh, find? See here, we insert it successfully, A and 1 and B. Uh, this A is insert successfully because uh, by, the, by the difference is when this time this is gonna just be a regular compound index but after I insert this index okay will be convert will be convert to compound multi-key index automatically because the array value here now I will insert another one Will it be successful? No, it won't be uh, successful because see here, when we create an index, right? And after this, uh, the, the component index is based on the A and B. And after the insert this, va this document, and it become a compound multi-key index. And as we know, for the uh, multi-key index and in the compound multi-key index, we cannot have uh, Sorry here. We cannot have uh, two fields or two fields which hold uh, array values. Now the A hold array values. B also hold array values. This is against this uh, index, so it won't create a insert a successfully. Okay. Let me show you. See here failed. Okay. See when we create uh, when we try to create it violate to this uh, parallel array because a and b both are array now so it cannot insert it successfully so let, let me show you the documents now it is still the previous value okay and uh, this is the uh, limitation for the multi key index for the multi key and if you want to have a compound multi key index only one array is allowed and uh, uh, because of the schemaless uh, schemaless uh, uh, feature in mongodb and when you insert if both uh, both of the key used in your index hold the array value then insertion gonna be failed okay and there are other limitation like uh, you cannot using hashed uh, index as the uh, in the multi key, or you cannot uh, using the multi key index in the shard uh, as a, you you cannot using the shard key as a multi key index, which means your uh, what's the your document is uh, uh, distributed in multiple in servers. Then in that case, you, we cannot using multi key index on that field. Okay. And uh, this is the first part about the multi-key uh, index. And uh, our next video, I'm gonna show you a query. When we have a multi-key, the query gonna be a little bit different, okay? And uh, see you, bye-bye.